Okay, so making a little video about my new uh, Jixxer 1000 2014. Um, I used to have the 2012, but it actually got stolen. A uh, few mods I did on this one. As you can see, I actually put uh, a prick protector and same uh, case savers from Yoshimura. They also do the black uh, for those case savers. I actually choose that color, so it actually pops out a little bit more. The colors are a little bit more, you know, uh, there's more contrast in the colors. So it makes it a little bit more stylish. I choose those ones. They're pretty good. Look good at least. Um, other than that, the other change I made. Um, so I put a Yoshimura R77D slip on. I used to have on the 2012 IR77. The main difference is just actually the cap. At the end, it's just one cap. That's exactly the same. I don't know if you can see. The sound is pretty much the same. Other change I did. Uh, fender eliminator kit. I used also to have the Yoshimura fender eliminator kit on the last on the 2012. The main difference between the new one and the last one is going to be that this one actually has four LEDs on it. The other one used to have only two. Uh, looks pretty good at night. Um, same, pretty stylish. Looks good. Yoshimura, I like that brand. So that's why I choose that one. On this side, what else? Same, uh, case saver, protectors. Uh, those are all pretty stylish. Uh, they're, they look really good instead of having, you know, the realm bulky bulky round uh, protectors I choose those ones because you know they they're not everyone else and they don't have them and it looks pretty good I mean not a lot of people have them and it looks really really good so that's why I choose that one um, other change I made I added uh, a RAM mount for iPhone it actually uh, allowed me to use my iPhone when I'm riding I actually use my iPhone more like a GPS so I can actually you know go through town and know exactly where I am and where I'm going so this is really practical hold it pretty well really steady it's pretty good other difference I actually put also an HID ballast here so I have an HID on on the bike uh, looks pretty good put 8k on it so I don't know if you guys actually can see it from here but it looks pretty pretty good uh, I know the bike's a little bit dirty so you know you can see that you know like watermarks and everything I, I need to, to to clean it but it looks pretty good especially at night you know a little bit bluish uh, it's really really good uh, at least I like them other than that um, let me show you the sound the sound of the exhaust that's pretty good uh, give me one sec I'm gonna turn it on and this is gonna move let's see if it doesn't move there you go. So as you can see, the HIDs, uh, the HID, the LEDs. We're gonna have four LEDs over here that are pretty, pretty light. Uh, the exhaust, good airflow. The sound is amazing. I don't know if you can hear it really well, but. sounds amazingly good at least I like it um, feel free to give me any feedback any comment or uh, whatever you think or you know I actually installed everything myself so if you have any questions or anything let me know post a comment down and I uh, will be able to answer it as soon as I can um, let me know what you think about the bike let me know if you have you know something similar uh, post some responses uh, with your bikes and uh, let's see what you guys have if you have any other questions or anything let me know at least you know this is my bike and uh, seriously love it looks really really good okay guys I uh, hope you like it and uh, uh, let me any comment if you want to bye